it was given a series motor drawing 20 amperes running at a speed 1000. Reduce the speed to N2 that is 600 by adding some extra resistance in series with the armature. First, let us calculate EB, first case. EB1 is equal to V minus that is 200 minus I1 is 20 into 0 0.4 that is 192 volts. Next, it was given T proportional to N square T2 by T1 is equal to N2 by N1 square. This was given in the question, that is the condition, it was asked to assume. And naturally in a series motor, T proportional to Ia square. So, T2 by T1 is equal to Ia2 by Ia1 square. So, finally we can say Ia2 by Ia1 square is equal to N2 by N1 square. Therefore, Ia2 by Ia1 is equal to N2 by N1. Next, from this Ia2 is equal to what is N2? 600. N1? 1000. What is Ia1? 20. So, if you calculate, you are going to get 12 amperes as Ia2. Now, we know a relationship E B proportional to phi n E B 2 by E B 1 is equal to phi 2. In place of phi 2, we can put I A 2 by I A 1 into N 2 by N 1 because flux proportional to I A in series motor. So, what is E B 2? 200 minus what is I A 2? 12 into what is Ra plus Rsc 0.4 plus we have to find some R external that is EB2 by what is EB1 192 is equal to what is Ia2 12 Ia1 20 into what is N2 600 by N1 is 1000. If you solve this you are going to get R external is equal to So finally, if you add 10.5 ohms in series with the armature, then the motor speed reduces from 1000 to 600 rpm.